Good morning guys, 6.23 a.m. We're at the ferry port, we're leaving Koh Rong today. The only problem we have is our ferry ticket says 7 a.m. on it, so we're here, like half six. It's that way. And Lucy, Lucy has wandered down. Okay, I think we're on the wrong pier. She's just signing to me. She's walked way over there to try and find where we need to go. Apparently it's over there, so that's good. Because this office here says, office opens at 8 a.m. First ferry, 10.30. And we're like, we've got a connecting bus. We're definitely gonna miss our bus, but hopefully it's good news. Hopefully we have time for some breakfast and some coffee just before we leave this island. We're sad to leave. It's actually leaving. Uh, 45 minutes earlier than our original ticket says but it's lucky that we've gone and checked because otherwise it would have just gone and we'd have been here like yeah. waiting for a bit of some turn up but we found the right pier now we found someone who's checked our tickets and now we're just waiting no time for coffee or breakfast well maybe there is but we don't want to risk it no exactly I don't think it's worth it <laughs> I do literally got off the boat here and then just walked along the pier and found some breakfast. I've got jam on toast, three bits of jam and they really spread it for me. Yum, got some eggs and bacon. We're then getting a bus from just up there. Travel day. I think they're expecting rain. Look at that umbrella. <laughs> the just got off the tuk-tuk and that is our bus. Good timing. Weirdly smooth travel day so far. Just checked into the bus uh, station here and we've got about 50 minutes until our bus leaves. Here nice and early. Always do that, but I'd rather that than be late. And weirdly, as we've left the beach, it started raining, so quite good timing. How nice was the weather the whole time we were in Koh Rong? Oh, incredible. It's so different here to Koh Rong. I boarded the bus. It's actually a smaller bus because I guess not as many people. <laughs> No. Not as many people um, were on this trip, so they've put us on a smaller bus, but we've got air conditioning. Yeah. And Lucy has found a little friend. <laughs> and so begins the four hour journey to Phnom Penh, the capital of Cambodia. You're so dramatic. I'm not dramatic. <laughs> Just pulled up at some random bit of the road, and like people are like sticking their like, products and we're the only tourists on here and we'd be like buying stuff and we're like passing through changes <laughs> so bus journey complete we've arrived in Phnom Penh very very busy capital this is reminding us of Bangkok so far the bus ended up being two hours longer than it should have been which is a bit of a shame it means it's more like five o'clock now so the day's kind of running away from us a little bit uh, we got some stuff to do when we get to the hotel but we're staying at a cool place so we're staying at a place called tea house which is run by the same people as the sock sand beach resort so if it's as nice as sock sand we're in for a nice couple of nights here This place is amazing. They've just brought our luggage up. We have the most inc well, incredible view for sunset. Let me show you. Overlooking the whole city. How nice is that? So we have to say a big thank you for the Tea House, which is the name of this hotel for putting us up in this hotel in Phnom Penh. And it's a Japanese style hotel. They've, and the room is huge. You've got like a whole little, wait a minute. So as you come in the door, we have a wardrobe. We have a nice long mirror. We have a little station here for tea. Coffee in the morning. Tea, no, it's a tea house. No, coffee. There is coffee. <gasps> we are obsessed with this, by the way. Yeah. We don't like instant coffee. This is insane. If you ever see this in the shop, buy it. It's amazing. We've got an amazing view. That sun sets here, so it's perfect. We'll watch the sunset in a minute. TV, a menu for room service. Yep. Nice. A desk. 
little uh, mini bar and kettle area over there. We've got one bed here because I think I guess this is like a family room, which is really nice. They've given us a nice big one. Um, oh, this mirror is cool. Look, have you seen that? Oh yeah. All like bits of wood and stuff. Love that. Oh wow, and that looks like a floor. Oh, that's a cool ceiling. Yeah. I've never seen a ceiling like that. Anyway, um, nice bed here. It's huge. This looks a bit nicer than the bed we've been staying in for the last two nights. <gasps> and a hot shower. Oh my god, I can't wait to get in here in a minute. The bathroom in here is lovely. It's I've really nice. Water. Wow, Walking these look shower. Nice. Some nice products there. Yeah. Wow. Look at that. That's nice. A toilet roll. Kissing. Our plan now is to write the weekly juice. We need to work on something else that we're thinking of bringing out and also also reply to some emails and write a blog post and so I need boring, food. Everyone. I need food. We need food. We haven't mm. eaten today. It is currently I don't have my phone on me. It's ten past five. So we've only got about an hour until the sun goes down. So we might go out and find some food or we see what's in this local area. We're not even sure where whereabouts we are. the first time I've been on a lift since travelling. We're obviously in dinner now and um, we're going to check out the restaurant here at Tea House. We looked at the um, menu for the room service, it looked amazing, so if it's anything like that we're going to retreat. The menu looks so good here. They pretty much do, well, loads of stuff. Obviously loads of Asian stuff. So loads of starters like chicken satay, spring rolls. I went straight to, they do soups. I'm keeping it Asian. I'm going stir fried noodles, beef, yellow noodle and egg. So I'm stuck between that and that. Lucy just loves like, pasta. You know, I love parmesan and I haven't had parmesan. Get it. I feel bit guilty. Though. Eaten so many noodles, get it. So I'm filming you through a forest here. But... Sorry, feel free. <laughs> this is a fresh juice. Like these are like the ones you used to make at home. With us. I know. I think we miss it. I must have a fresh fruit juice with your dinner. That's so refreshing. Pineapple, spinach. Can't remember the others, but. Uh, oh, what was in yours? Melon and honey and lime. It's ice cold. It's lovely. Honey and lime. Yeah. Mm, that's spot on. Lovely. And I have one coming that is the clean. So cucumber, spinach, pineapple, lemon, and ginger. And that was George's. So actually, there's not lime in yours, but there's mint. Thank you so much. Can I have some chopsticks, please? Thank you. Go on, try it then. The noodles. You just bring me some chopsticks. You're so authentic. I know. <laughs> this looks insane. It's like fresh basil and ch cherry tomatoes. And this is actually amazing. This tastes like so. Like you sometimes think the noodles and vegetables. How how good can you make that? Like it's basic stuff and it's tasty, but. This is like next level, it's all kind of mixed in together, posher and all that. I guess we're in a really nice hotel. Very impressed. And mine has all different coloured tomatoes in and it tastes absolutely insane. It's time for us to say goodnight. <gasps> Actually, before we go, let me are we on the right floor? Um what floor are Did you press? Yeah, that looks bright. Let me before we go, let me show you this screen out here that we've been looking at. This is the view from our room. So it's not home. Isn't it? Oh yeah, that was a different screen. But so cool, look at this skyline, it's awesome. Look at that, that <gasps> as well, nice. There's a bar up there, we need to find that. Thanks for watching today guys, hope you enjoyed coming along on our little travel day. We're gonna head to sleep now, we need to upload the video and the upload speed is like 40 meg isn't it, so we're happy with that. Shouldn't Top notch. Long. Top notch. Please subscribe if you're not subscribed already. Please subscribe if you're not subscribed already. And please smile.